All right, we open up our box. I got my dead front off already, but we're going to be checking voltage. We go to one leg coming in, white wire, black wire coming in, and we should have roughly 240, 244. Uh, each leg is 120, and to confirm that, you go from the white wire to your ground bus, and you should have about 120. And go to your other leg to your ground, and you should have 120. Now, if we go across here again, all right, 240, breakers turned on, we should go to the bottom. And we should have 240 as well and we don't have anything this tells me my breaker is bad i'm gonna go secure power come back we're gonna pull the breaker out and check resistance across the breaker in the on position and just like that i got my breaker secured we're gonna check for volts again I always double check all right so pretty much zero take this out they just popped in All right, we're gonna change this to ohms. So on, you wanna go from your backside to your front screw. All right, so that one's good. It was, right there, that's good. The other side, I got up back there. I'm reading OL, that means it's open, so half this breaker is bad. All right, so let's get a new one put in. All right, I got my new breaker, 40 bucks from Home Depot, square D, 60 amp. That's what came out of here. So we're going to go ahead and uh, put these wires back in. All you do is loosen up your screws down here. Give a good little tug. <clears throat> All right, like I said, they just snap in. Let me see if I can get you a little closer here. All right, here we go. So, the breaker. These are the top. These are the bottom. As you can see right in here, the bottom snap into here. There's no power there, so the bottom snaps into there. And that uh, bar right there and that bar right there, that's where the top snap into. So, let's see if I can do this one hand. All right. So, right there, bottom snapped in, top snapped in. All right, let's go turn on power. We're going to leave this off and turn on power, check power, turn it on, check power again, and we should be good. All right, with power turned back on, that was quick. We're going to test here for voltage, and we have voltage, 243. If I did it right, we turn this on. Test down here for voltage. And we got 243. So we're done. Just that simple. Don't be scared of electricity. It will jump out and bite you. But if you do it right, there's nothing to be afraid of.